Welcome to Brazil, a vibrant and diverse country known for its stunning natural landscapes, rich cultural heritage, and bustling cities. From the breathtaking Iguazu Falls to the famous beaches of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil has something for every type of traveler. In this video, we'll be exploring some of Brazil's top tourist attractions, showcasing the best that this amazing country has to offer. Before we dive into today's video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications to join our travel community and stay up to date on all our latest adventures. We've got some amazing content coming up, so make sure you don't miss out. Thanks for subscribing, and now, let's get started. Cristo Redentor, or Christ the Redeemer, is one of the most iconic landmarks in Brazil and is located in the Corcovado section of Rio de Janeiro. This towering statue of Jesus Christ stands at 30 meters tall and has become a symbol of both the city and the country. The statue was designed by French sculptor Paul Landowski and constructed by Brazilian engineer Haider da Silva Costa in collaboration with French engineer Albert Cockwatt. It was built between 1922 and 1931 and has since become one of the most visited tourist attractions in Brazil. To reach the statue, visitors must take a scenic train ride through the Tijuca Forest, the largest urban forest in the world, which provides breathtaking views of Rio de Janeiro and its coastline. Once at the top, visitors can take in the stunning panoramic views, enjoy a guided tour of the statue, or simply take in the beauty and serenity of the surroundings. The Iguazu Falls is one of the most impressive natural attractions in Brazil, located in the southern state of Pirani. The falls are situated on the Iguazu River, which forms the border between Brazil and Argentina. The Iguazu Falls consist of a collection of 275 individual waterfalls spread out over 2.7 kilometers, with a maximum height of 82 meters. The falls are surrounded by lush rainforest and are home to a wide variety of flora and fauna, including many endangered species. Visitors to the Iguazu Falls can enjoy breathtaking views of the cascading waterfalls from a variety of vantage points, including walkways and viewing platforms that extend out over the falls. Boat tours are also available, providing a unique perspective from below. The falls are located within the Iguazu National Park, which is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and one of the most important protected areas in South America. The park is home to an incredible array of wildlife, including jaguars, ocelots, and giant otters, as well as over 400 species of birds. Copacabana is one of the most iconic neighborhoods in Rio de Janeiro and is world-renowned for its beautiful beach and vibrant atmosphere. The neighborhood is located on the southern coast of the city and stretches for over 4 kilometers along the Atlantic Ocean. Copacabana Beach is the main attraction of the neighborhood and is one of the most famous beaches in the world. The beach is lined with a wide variety of restaurants, bars, and shops and is a popular destination for both tourists and locals alike. Visitors can enjoy swimming, sunbathing, surfing, and a variety of other water sports, as well as taking in the sights and sounds of this lively neighborhood. Copacabana is also famous for its vibrant nightlife, with a wide variety of bars, nightclubs, and live music venues catering to all tastes and preferences. Visitors can enjoy everything from samba and bossa nova to electronic music and hip-hop, as well as a variety of delicious Brazilian cuisine. Ipanema is a trendy beach neighborhood located in the southern zone of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. This neighborhood is world-famous for its picturesque beaches, upscale shops, and trendy restaurants and bars. Eponima Beach is one of the most beautiful and well-known beaches in Rio, and it stretches for over 2 kilometers along the Atlantic Ocean. The beach attracts both tourists and locals who come to enjoy swimming, sunbathing, surfing, and other water sports. Aside from the beach, Eponima is also known for its upscale shopping and dining scene. Visitors can find a variety of high-end shops and boutiques, selling designer clothing, jewelry and accessories, as well as a range of trendy restaurants serving up delicious Brazilian and international cuisine. Apodema is also renowned for its vibrant nightlife, with a variety of bars, nightclubs, and live music venues catering to all tastes and preferences. Visitors can enjoy everything from samba and bossa nova to electronic music and hip-hop 
as well as a variety of delicious Brazilian cocktails and cuisine. The Amazon rainforest is the world's largest tropical rainforest and covers an area of over 6.7 million square kilometers, spanning nine countries in South America, with the majority of it located in Brazil. It is one of the most biodiverse regions on Earth, home to an incredible array of plant and animal species, many of which are found nowhere else on the planet. The Amazon rainforest plays a crucial role in regulating the world's climate and is often referred to as the lungs of the planet due to its capacity for producing oxygen and absorbing carbon dioxide. It is also home to many indigenous communities who have lived in the region for thousands of years and have developed unique cultures and traditional knowledge. There are many ways to explore the Amazon rainforest, from taking guided tours on foot or by boat to staying in eco-lodges and engaging in activities like wildlife viewing, bird watching, hiking, and fishing. Visitors can also learn about the rich cultural heritage of the region through interactions with local communities who offer guided tours and cultural activities. The Amazon rainforest is also a popular destination for researchers and scientists who study the unique flora and fauna of the region and work to better understand its ecological and environmental importance. Pelerino is a historic neighborhood located in Salvador, the capital city of the state of Bahia, Brazil. The neighborhood is known for its vibrant cultural scene, colorful colonial architecture, and rich history, which dates back to the 16th century. Pelerino was once the center of the African slave trade in Brazil, and the neighborhood's name comes from the pillory, where slaves were punished and publicly humiliated. Today, the neighborhood is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and is home to many cultural institutions, museums and galleries that celebrate the Afro-Brazilian heritage of the region. In addition to its architecture, Pelourinho is also known for its lively music and dance scene, with many street performers and live music venues showcasing the traditional rhythms and dances of Bahia, such as samba, capoeira, and foro. Visitors can also find a variety of restaurants and cafes serving up delicious Bahian cuisine which is known for its rich flavors and African influences. Ouro Preto is a picturesque colonial town located in the state of Minas Gerais, Brazil. Founded in the 17th century, the town is known for its well-preserved colonial architecture and rich history and is a designated UNESCO World Heritage Site. Ouro Preto's name means black gold in Portuguese, and it was once a major center of the gold rush that brought wealth and prosperity to the region. Today, visitors can explore the town's many historic buildings and monuments, including the ornate Baroque-style churches, museums, and colonial houses. One of the most famous landmarks of Ouro Preto is the Church of St. Francis of Assisi, which is widely regarded as one of the most beautiful churches in Brazil. The church's interior is decorated with intricate sculptures and paintings by some of the most famous artists of the Baroque era. In addition to its cultural attractions, Oro Preto is also known for its stunning natural scenery, with many hiking trails and outdoor activities available in the surrounding hills and valleys. Ibirapuera Park is a large urban park located in the city of Sao Paulo, Brazil. The park covers an area of over 1.5 square kilometers and is considered one of the most important cultural and recreational areas in the city. The park was designed by the famous Brazilian architect Oscar Niemeyer, and was inaugurated in 1954 to commemorate the city's 400th anniversary. It features several cultural institutions and museums, including the Sao Paulo Museum of Modern Art, the Afro-Brazil Museum, and the Museum of Contemporary Art. In addition to its cultural attractions, Itarapuera Park is also a popular destination for outdoor activities, with many walking and jogging trails, bike paths, and sports facilities available. The park also features several lakes and ponds and is home to a diverse range of flora and fauna, including over 160 species of birds. The Botanical Garden of Curitiba is a popular tourist attraction located in the city of Curitiba in the state of Paran, Brazil. The garden was designed in the French style and covers an area of over 245,000 square meters, making it one of the largest botanical gardens in Brazil. The garden is famous for its impressive greenhouse, 
which features a beautiful Art Nouveau design and houses a wide variety of exotic plants from all over the world. The greenhouse is divided into several sections, including a tropical forest, a desert, and a flower exhibition. Another popular feature of the Botanical Garden of Curitiba is the impressive Botanical Museum, which houses a collection of over 300,000 plant specimens. The museum also features interactive exhibits and educational displays, providing visitors with an opportunity to learn about the rich diversity of plant life in Brazil and beyond. Visitors to the garden can also enjoy a stroll through its many outdoor areas, which include several beautiful gardens and parks, a lake, and a pedestrian walkway that offers stunning views of the garden and the city skyline. The garden also features several fountains, sculptures, and art installations, adding to its unique and artistic character. The Sugarloaf Mountain is another popular tourist attraction in Rio de Janeiro, located in the Urca neighborhood. This distinctive peak rises 396 meters above the city and offers stunning panoramic views of Rio de Janeiro's skyline, Guanabara Bay, and the surrounding mountains. Visitors can reach the summit of Sugarloaf Mountain via a cable car ride that takes them on a thrilling journey up to the top. The cable car ride offers breathtaking views of the city and its coastline, and the journey itself is an experience not to be missed. At the top of the mountain, visitors can take in the spectacular views, enjoy a meal or a drink at one of the restaurants, or simply relax and enjoy the scenery. There are also several hiking trails around the mountain for those who prefer to explore on foot. 